Welcome back everyone. The primaries are over. Now it's time for the real hard part. For some candidates, they're focusing on runoffs. Others, the November election or the job at hand. Yeah, News 8 political analyst Jeff Eller is here with us live in studio this morning. Jeff, I know you just got back Good morning. from Washington. Thanks for coming in so early. We appreciate it. Happy to. Uh, busy night for you as well. What stands out? What are some of the surprises uh, for you this morning? Um, I, you know, I, we were we talked about yesterday morning that we thought that Perry would probably not have a runoff. Mm -hmm. and, and I think it was ultimately somewhat of a surprise that the gap between him and Mrs. Hutchison was so great that um, no runoff. Uh, the Republicans say they're united and they're heading into November. I, the, the really actually the one big surprise was an incumbent railroad commissioner got beat. And I think that caught a lot of people by surprise. We spoke with Bill White about 30 minutes ago, and he said that he wants to run a very bipartisan campaign now, and that if you listen to Governor Perry's speech from last night, it was incredibly partisan. Right. Can he stick to bipartisanism and win in November? Oh, I think it's a great thing to talk about in these early stages of the campaign. I think as, uh, as we get closer to November, you'll see that probably evaporate, and this will turn into a pretty traditional race where those two are going to go at it, and they're going to go at it pretty hard, I think. Jeff, how divisive was the GOP primary between the senator and governor? It was, I would say it was damaging, but not, uh, not to the point where it can't be healed. She certainly laid the framework last night that she wants to unite the party and move forward. Uh, there's a lot of time between now and November. Uh, they have a, 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 you know, probably a pretty strong desire to keep the governorship as much as they can. I think you'll see them probably, it won't be tomorrow, it won't be in a week. But it'll come together. I want to ask you this because we talked with Bill White about it earlier. A recent newspaper poll of registered voters said they don't know who he is. How is he going to overcome uh, Governor Perry's name recognition? Well, he's got nine million cash on hand in the bank. Long time between now and November. He is a hard worker. He is a, he will campaign hard, and he has an opportunity to move a lot of television starting after Labor Day, and those numbers will come up. Okay, Jeff Eller, get some sleep. We appreciate you Thank coming you. in early. <laughs> Thank you. Now let's get a check on your forecast for.